Essen 2, Overwatch 2, Battlefront 2, a lot of twos in this, um, Modern Warfare 2. The gaming space is just in a really, I'm just called DS, what should I say, it's in, it's in a real DS position. Um, and I could go on and on about how much you, you developers really don't give a fuck. Activision's all that shit, y'all really don't give a fuck either. Y'all just think y'all can print money. We need new. Not just I. I think we just need new. We need new developers. We need just a, a whole change in this space right now. Because if I'm being real honest with you, I believe the people back then, you know, the ones that made Halo, the ones that made all the games that we... I, in the other video, I brought up the PS2 games. I, I will show you that. But we just need a change. It's crazy because every time we think we're getting a positive change, like with Battlefront 2, bringing the game back to life after... You go and you go fucking sink it again. Like, what was the point? Literally, what was the point? I, I don't know. I, I literally don't fucking know. Or like, I know SM2 just got dropped today. Y'all are just some scared ass bitches. Respectfully, not really. I'll take that back because you know you're wrong. I know you know you own it, but you don't do shit. And on top of that, you rather add rat skins in your games instead of taking the information that you know works and that everybody praises and just building off of that. Same thing with EA, same thing with anybody else who right now is is really making games at the moment. It's it's just a whole unless you're Elder Ring or, or God of War or I mean, I really don't want to say Sony right now because I know people probably have their things with Sony, but at least their game line right now is consistent. Can we at least just say that? Not even on the, I have an Xbox, so all you people are, mm. look, bro, not even Xbox. We've been struggling for fucking ever. I still want a dashboard change. I'd rather still have the Xbox 360 dashboard than the newest dashboards that they keep giving. I don't know why, but that's just my preference. I don't understand why that can't be arranged, why we can't just go back or you can't have something in a setting that makes our dashboard an Xbox 360, essentially. I would love that, me personally but still like what are we doing I, I guess that's just my question like you just every time a gamer or gamers get excited for something we immediately get fucking shot in the foot game not being developed or underdeveloped or buggy or not really good on release 30 frames like we're still back in ps2 era days or some shit ps3 era days like okay like I don't, I just completely, and I understand, like, I don't play video games. I understand, like, all the people are, but for the people who make video games, and for the people who care, and for the people who listen, like the Warframe people, um, and I really don't even play Warframe, but I do know from people in the community, they do listen. Oh, even a lot, just, even more than Call of Duty ever has. Sorry, I'm gonna put it like that. More than EA probably ever has, because Lord knows if Battlefront 2 was still popping, I would be on that hope right now. It's hard to find a game. I can't even, I can't even get into a lobby on Xbox. It's hard to find a game. You'll be sitting there forever. But still, like, it, it's just real sad. It's, it's all real sad because I know in this world, we've got people with great ideas, the same great ideas, you know, that make games that we love. Sorry to bring, actually, no, nah, I'll just put it back in the video. I was going to bring out the PS3. But still, like, everybody right now is just like in a slump like you just think, think you can just hand us dog shit and we're just not gonna talk about it and i mean in some cases you'll be right because it'll take a minute for us to talk about that dog shit but i'm, I'm really tired of this live service half big bs era of video games i'm sorry i'm sorry that's just how it is i, I really wish we could go back to the one game if it's ass throw it away at least, at least, if, if you put all your effort in its, in its dog shit, you know, you go back, you take the information, and you learn from it. Fine. You sitting here trying to drag out this dog shit and keep giving out hope. Ooh, two years later. Ooh, five years later. Like, no. Literally, no. 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 Every single time something comes out. Unless you're Elden Ring, like I said, I, I have my exclusive list. You have your exclusive list. MW2 better not be on an exclusive list. You are fucking dog shit if it is. But still every time it's like i don't know i just want to make a quick video letting all the developers who actually give a fuck and all the publishers who actually give a fuck about their games actually care about the system of which you know we've been feeding shit but you know actually actually want to make an impact i think it's your time to shine i think we need shift that's gonna do it for the video if you have any opinions, leave them down in the comments. I would love to hear your opinions. But for me right now, it just seems like we just keep getting constantly fully loaded guns that we don't know are fully loaded guns and shooting ourselves in the foot. And not us, like y'all. 
I mean, you give us the gun thinking that we're going to fall for it. And then we play the game and we shoot ourselves in the foot by buying it. I guess you could say that too. But again, when people are constantly promising us shit, Overwatch 2. Thank God I didn't buy the game. Because I was really looking forward to this whole new, ooh, hero progression. Ooh, they're really going to play into this. Like, y'all are really good. Really good at being professional money wasters. Really good at not listening to your community. And really good at not listening to what things have already done that worked. You're really good at, at, at putting things that have already worked into bad use. Into horrible use. In fact, you don't use them at all. You rather just sit there and be like, ooh, that was an accident one off. That's how you seem like you act. But you, it'll, it'll just never happen again. It's not possible. Which is complete bull and utter bull. Like I said, I don't I don't believe that. I really don't. But but y'all have a good day. And uh, you know, hopefully by the time I'm not 30, which is another what, nine years? I ain't gotta wait till I'm 30 to get an actual good game.